Hi guys, Rob from Roll Balls. We're down here at ARP Constrictors and guess who I bumped into? We got David Suarez from Indonesia here. Hi. Fantastic. You want to do an intro? Fantastic, all right, yeah. So this is the ugliest one in the thing that we have. What do you think is this? This is actually calm, for sure. Okay. You don't think any blade in that? No, you don't think so. Blade. Blade? Okay, let's talk about blade. It's also the same question when I go to Thailand. Everybody asking me about blade, what do you think about blade? In my opinion, blade is not a moth. It's a line blade. It's stuff, a right? line blade, it's a quality stuff. Mm. Right. Yeah, that's my opinion, but you know, some some people not agree with me. That's right, because there's a, there's a history no there's a history to these and, and, and it kind of bears that out as well because the original clowns you didn't think had, had any blade, they weren't sold as blade. And it's taken years to, make to get that look. So it took back me four again. to five generations to make something that okay, this is the, the worst out of the three because he picked the nicest, I picked the nicer one really. So the ones that we have is so much cleaner and like the, the pattern is just much more neat, there's not much. For the NG clown or just a regular clown? NG clown. So I mean this visually is very different to this NG. So this is the uh, first uh, clown, the reduced clown or NG blade clown that uh, we talked about with David. So uh, just get a look at uh, what this snake actually looks like. Uh, this one is the one that uh, I have, putting on some uh, decent size now. Uh, but you can see that um, the uh, the pattern, even for an Enchi clown, is uh, very very reduced. Uh, very very clean sides, no markings at all on the uh, on the sides of the snake. You can see the very very clean sides. So this is the snake that we're talking about with David, uh, and this is what uh, we, we we were discussing when we meant the uh, Enchi blade or Enchi reduced pattern clown. Because I I have a, I have a pastel Enchi female as well, and it's got it as they get older they get this dirty look down the sides, mm, this one. And, it, and it's not so the the banding on the back is just not so clean. But this one will also get dirty. Yes, it will. Yes, yeah. This is already coming out. Just so we we're, we've been trying for the Firefly Enchi yes. clown to yes. clean it up. Yes. And he's got a Firefly Enchi head for clown, which is just it's just it pops, but it's not a visual clown. We're both trying for it. So that's the male. See, this is, this one looks like a super Enchi clown, but it's not. Yeah. But you came to my place. I have an uh, Enchi clown. That have dots, 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 dots. Yeah. Dots, so why dots. it happens? They say it's because of the blade, but it's not. We I don't have any blade in my collection. No. They, so this is the the thing about blade. It's just a random stuff coming out, and then when you breed the good one and the good one, so it's basically, it gets better. Yeah. Uh, so you can by line breeding clean up the yes. entry. Mm -hmm. Uh because uh, when we start this, maybe like. You you know mm -hmm. we already start this for a long time yeah. and we, when we start this this stuff there are no blade yeah when we first how come this uh, appear yeah. yeah and then suddenly someone calling blade for a very reduced pattern card mm, yeah you know when when we start there was just reduced yes. card reduced pattern card yes. and a normal card yes yeah. now no, nobody pattern. now Busy, nobody is talking about pattern and uh, reduced pattern no nobody talk about reduced pattern again because they name it blade now yes and then if it is a moth why we don't see any blade, normal blade? Mm. No, right. it's it just like a, a reduced pattern, normal head count. Mm. Everything will be head count. There will be no normal blade. Mm. You, 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 yeah. you get what I what I mm. mean, right? It yeah. has to be. It has to be in clown. Yeah. It doesn't show up yeah. anywhere else. That's why I say that's not a ball. I say it's always related to clown. Because so, I never worked with blade, I never had a blade. Yeah. But you see things like this pop up, and because I don't have a blade, I also don't know what is going on with blade. Because you, your stuff also come from from Justin. Yeah. Justin stuff, uh, maybe her grandparents or something between them, mm -hmm. it has a reduced pattern line. So it will come out of mm -hmm. processionally and then when you print the good one with the good one, mm -hmm. it came more be beautiful. From what I learned until today, what makes an NC crown looks like this mm -hmm. and, and with my with my one with spot on yeah. like spot, this spot like this. Why 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 other people person doesn't look like that? Ah. From my opinion, it's related to the hands. Because from what I learned, most of my stuff look like 
this, the, the, like a super rancy cloud, they all have polar vendors. Well, maybe this one have for Arduino? Any my, my is not. This one is from a head to head pairing. Maybe head to head. Or a head to a visual. visual. So the head may have been. But I made the head. I made everything back to the first cloud I got in from the seat. So, and because it didn't appear earlier, the first, second, third generation didn't appear, the fourth generation suddenly appeared. Mm -hmm. That is why I'm very confused. Mm -hmm. So, maybe this with the orange dream would look nice. But yes. not that much. One orange dream, but and if you put an orange dream and a yellow belly, it should look nice. But the problem is, I worry when we put the yellow belly, the pattern starts getting fuzzy. Because again. yellow belly tends to to do some things here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah. If and see, there are no yeah. <laughs> nothing here. Mm. So I don't think that's a good combination. Yeah. I think it's gonna uh, mess it up. It's, it's also the same with the spider con. They have nothing here. The yellow belly do something here. Mm. So. If you want to go with the yellow valley, my suggestion is black pastel. Black pastel make everything here. It's higher, higher the the size. Then it goes, goes close to and, the and again, yeah. black, pompe, black pastel pompe. is something that is not common here in Malaysia. You yeah. don't have any. I don't have any oh, because really? I had because I had cinnamon, I had red exotic, I had sable. Sable, so I have too many ah, black stuff. Ah, I I I I I don't play with cinnamon. I don't. Yes, I don't want that. After I got the banana breeding for four seasons I never sell any banana. I keep then uh, I keep only the nice one. I pair with only because I believe a lot of these normal or a lot of moths depend on what kind of normals you use them with. Like you see the hats right? I believe when you use very clean normals with very little dirt, very very uh, nice pattern, very very like uh, very clean or very clean normals as a base and then we get the bananas into that, I think it makes a difference. Okay. I think it, it makes a difference for almost all of them because I think you realize that's like Definitely, all of us realize there's the jungle pattern normals, there's yeah. the alien head yeah. normals, there's different normals. There is certain normals that make certain different effects. Yeah, to the they, 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 they affect the offspring, mm -hmm. that's for sure. Just people don't realize it. Yes. Just normal, yeah, it's normal, but... Well, I'm, I'm, I'm constantly surprised at some of the stuff that you do with just lime breeding. Not, no special genetics in there, just lime bread, and they come out... It's, it's almost like a different snake. The really high this quality a, stuff. This is a bumblebee calico. Bumblebee calico. Yeah. Now. But that's a shit I do. <laughs> that's, that's one of the worst ones he produces. That is the worst one I've ever produced. Okay. And then I slowly made it to look like this. This shedding one, but you can see it's, yeah, a, yeah, it's a much better version of that. <laughs> Go and then he eventually did this. How clean is that? Yeah, that's clean. So this is where I thought it's gonna stop. I don't think so. It's gonna because as they grow big, you know that the whites become very white, become yeah. very clean and everything. Right? So I thought that is where it's gonna max out. Yeah, I know you make better one there. Yeah. <laughs> and then we made this this year. That looks like a, that looks yes, like sir. that with Odi, bro. Oh, bumblebee calico. This is all bumblebee calico. Yeah. Yes. Wow, yeah. this is crazy, man. <laughs> this one is. A sort of brownish color though it doesn't have the this is really yeah, black yeah, yeah, on the, the dorsal speckles, the, and, the, the and this is this is a kind of browny color it's it, it's almost like it's a different yeah and then speckles also gone yeah yeah uh, a yeah. little by a little but they're gone and the speckles it's all until they adults it will getting much more yeah yeah the the uh, the, the adult the father look at this guy he's awesome he's just awesome awesome, awesome. One of my favorite snakes in his collection, this one. So this fella was something like this when he was younger. Oh, wow. Between this and this. And uh, the uh, Calico Bumblebee line that uh, we talked about with David and that you can see in the line up here. Uh, this is a uh, female that uh, I kept back. Not the uh, best example, but one of the best examples of uh, Calico Bumblebee that uh, Awin has produced this year. Uh, she's very clean and bright and will get even cleaner still uh, with more sheds. Uh, she is actually just going into a shed cycle now so she's actually looking a little bit pink, not at her best. But uh, you can see the uh, uh, reduced pattern on the sides and how very very clean with a lack of spot she is along the, uh, along the flanks. This is the uh, flora and fauna line of Calico which gives uh, very high white sides. So this is an example of one of those uh, calico bumblebees that uh, we we discuss yeah, with, uh, with 
but this is this is where I thought it's going to stop because you know it's as clean as it gets already. But then this year we made this and if it was one then it's usually like you know that fluke that one fella happens to have different colour. But we made two of the fillers. Just uh, just hold them up to the, to the camera so that you can see the Yeah. You can see the progression. The second stage. The, the father's cleaner than all of those. Ah uh, no, the father the father was worse than him when he was younger. Yeah. The father was not as nice as this when he was younger. Because calicos get better with it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But the the things with calico is they are random sometimes. Mm. Uh, your calico stuff gives them really high, white, clean yeah. signs. I think it's a Calico lot to do with the original one also because uh, I got mine from Flora and Fauna Line. I think they no longer Flora and Fauna Line, yeah, yeah. Last yeah, time FNF Line was a big thing, but now yeah. nobody talks about it. Yeah. But I think sugar and calico are the same shit. Sugar and calico? I think sugar is just sugar a nice is the same yes. yes. Like butter and lesser. Butter and lesser. Confucian and acid. So this two is the same banana, thing. Banana, yeah. Banana, yeah. So they look the same, but uh, he's very small because he didn't want to eat very much. Yeah. But I think these two are basically the same stuff. Like. This is better, I think. Cleaner, right? More yeah. white. Mm, I think and it's it, that one's higher contrast than this one. Mm. <coughs> but usually the most beautiful one is hard to eat. Do you think it's a plate, Mom? Yes, Mom. It's not I had many cars and they are all different. I even have something crazier than this. You think these are all plain cloth? Okay, I'll tell you what happened. Huh? Okay. You saw the antique clown just now? Mm -hmm. I took that, I buried with a head clown. I got 10 babies. Yeah. 5 anti head clown, 5 clown. Okay. Not even one overlap, you know. What with what anti clown with? Normal head clown. You don't get any heads? No. This one is interesting. No, these are all crappy because he took the nice one home. <laughs> yeah, but this one is much more interesting than this. This tree, I can yeah, say that mine, this. mine has the the white sides that come right. Yeah, this right one is even, even more interesting. Then you and the pattern's really broken. This is what I want to keep and the one that he's keeping, the two we're keeping, but this tree we're not keeping. This yeah, one. this tree I can say that it's just a regular cone, mm -hmm. but this one is quite different. This one, yeah, you, you, you're supposed to keep this one to, to take this out because in the clowns today this, the trend is decide the that they want more them. this is my female ex clown that we also discussed uh, this is the uh, uh, the clown girl that um, uh, Awin also has a uh, an example of this and these are one of two snakes that David pointed out was not just a normal clown that uh, there was something interesting going on with them and you can see the pattern here um, she is quite banded in places you can see the uh, alien heads actually crossing over on her back here uh, another example here another example there and how broken up the uh, the dorsal stripe is it's 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 broken up almost enchi like you can see the awesome dragon head stamp that she has. You can see the the dragon head stamp there. And along the sides you can see that there's something funky going on down here on her on her flanks close to the belly. So um, whatever this gene is that's in here, whatever extra gene we've we've got, we need to uh, breed this out and uh, see what we do have but you can see that it's very very funky down the sides there not yellow belly we don't think it's yellow belly uh, but we'll be breeding this line of clown out to see exactly what we have so this is the uh, what we call the X clown this is my example of the yeah, they X clown yeah. last time they wanted they, they, they developed the, develop the yeah. pattern right they just want a clean pattern mm -hmm. but Today the trend is to make a busy clown with a nice color. Yeah, and you can you can see at the head, it's very bright. Yeah, why? Eh? You think there's something else? Right? But it's definitely not an anti clown. It's not for yeah. sure. Yeah, that's why. Yeah, that's quite interesting. So maybe we can buy this with this. Show you my crazy normal clown. Ah, my phone with my kids. 
So this is the one that they missed the... Uh, we didn't get the clown. We didn't get the clown. Pastel and she... The clowns, that's all? Pastel and she fire. Oh yeah. The shading like, going to shed. But this first color is quite nice. Uh, yeah, you, you put that one next to the pastel and I and mm. that one really pops. Yeah, firefly and it's, it's beautiful. So if it was a female, I would have been happy. Or if it was a clown version, I would have been very happy. So now I have a male of a triple G that I really like. I don't want to sell, but I don't know what to do with it. I cannot be... I, I don't know. Just create it with a clown. Yeah, I think probably... I think I probably will read one of those reviews. Keep piling it up. Okay, so these are the pipes that we have available at the moment actually. So that's quite a number, it's all kind of high whites, low whites, mid whites. That one that is very cool low white actually. Uh, there's only one male and uh, I believe the rest are all female. The leopard pipe, that's a very beautiful one. You can see it's very dark here and then there's one black dot there. And that's about it, there's nothing else on the whole body. That's a standard looking pipe just for comparison. So I just wanted to show you this boy because he looks cool. Yeah, very cool. Okay, so the stuff that we really want to show about pipes today, this stuff. Those are really bright compared to the sibling. You want to guess what's in them? Well, I would say uh, yellow belly orange dream. No, there's literally nothing in them, that's just pipe. That's just pipe. See, the color difference is quite significant. Now this is what we are talking. Because mm. I don't see anything special from, yeah. no. from this four. Yes. But this is not the special one. Okay. <laughs> this is where we made some crazy shit this year. These are just kind of what, what Alan would consider to be the top end of his, his pies. They're all just kind of Okay, that's interesting. Now these guys are different. This is what I was aiming to make nicer. But eventually they became this. Wow. So what do you think of G-Max? I want to hear something on G-Max. I don't know about G-Max. Because <laughs> when I looked at these, I thought Orange Dream Yellow Belly. But yeah, you, would have, you would have seen Orange Dream in the parents. They, okay, the thing is, when things look funky, right? There is no way that this... Okay, the banana, I'm not sure because it's the first time really. But the recessive stuff like this one, the enchies and all, I would have realized something going, is, is going on because fourth or fifth generation of I got the first nail pipe from Justin. Justin, probably Genex. But for 10 years, no. 10 years, nothing came out. Why now? Well, Genex is the only thing that could have crept in without you noticing it. If it was Orange Dream Yellow Belly, but it's 10 you years would have seen it. We, that we, we brought in a pair, and uh, one of it, I, I don't know which one, one that. This, this color here not is not supposed to be here. It's not supposed to be there. Tell that to the snake. Yeah. It's, it goes down real deep, doesn't it? Right down onto the onto and the belly scales. You see, you see this part? But I don't think it, it's a yellow belly. It's not. It's not. No. Yellow belly would have been very easy to see in the patterns. So what the hell are they? Hmm. Now show me the patterns. Siblings. Siblings? Yeah. Okay, this is your jackpot then. Yeah. The siblings, only that two look like that. These are all siblings. Only this is sibling with this. But these also do have the, the deep pattern. Yeah, but that one, this one is considered a just, just a decent quality. Really. It's not, not something that crazy. It's not ugly. It's a, it's, a, it's a nice quality, but it's not this. These yeah. are different. Yeah, this is different. This is something more. Also. Yes. Yes. And they're both males, and I'm trying to persuade him yeah. to, to let me have one of them. The, the father yeah. is a he leopard. Still let you. <laughs> the father is a leopard. No, he father. will. He will. <laughs> He's just got to figure out which one he wants to keep, which one he's going to let go. So the female is actually the daughter of the first pipe I imported. And the father is the son of the first pipe I imported. Oh, so, so this may be a leopard in here as well. There's definitely a leopard. There's definitely a leopard because these, these, are not, these are not the same part. No, no, this is what uh, I uh, discussed with my friends. Because he has a lot of leopard pipes mm. from a leopard pipe pair. pair. But we can't see the oh. leopard in pipes. I so, realized when yeah. the leopard with pipes are this. These are those that I lab label with leopard pipes. So how, how, how do you label them? <laughs> no, I need to learn them. First of all, I believe all leopard pipes are very, very high one. This, this, oh, I, really? this I can be very sure it's a leopard pipe. 
and the neck part is very dark. Yeah. That's all I can see. But I realize there is no low white leopard so far I've had. All the leopard parts are hatch as Because I bred I bred and I put what because this one you see? The father I put as leopard pipe, right? Huh? When I pet this leopard pipe with the albino and made a hat, I did get the leopard out straight. I mean it's definitely a leopard, I pulled oh, him out. Yeah. You you come from a generation where all leopards are head parts though, right? We did more than you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So until today I don't have any leopard pipe in my collection. Mm. Because uh, at that time I only got the leopard head clown. I, I take it back to Indonesia and the rest I I I, 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 I just put it put it there. And so that start my leopard clown collection. But I don't really I never think the leopard is linked with the pipe. So One thing that the what what I believe is the leopard that has stripes it's a pet pet pipe. That's why like, you know the, the Mojave yes. full stripe Mojave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah, we've seen a really I strong mean, influence yeah. on some mm -hmm. of the north. This is where they have what, what I believe, but I I don't believe that all uh leopards are pets. Have pets. Have pets. You see? Yeah, this but one. there is some that I can I can guarantee like most of it, like uh certain leopard pipes, for example. It's the white. I, I'm sure a lot of leopard pipes actually. You don't think this is a leopard pipe from the next you said it up here? No. Because is I've it, never seen a lower leopard pipe. Well, right? Yeah, right. Okay. Got that sort of darkish silver neck. This fella and this fella. Okay. So this one, I sell it. I sell maybe uh, same price as a high white pipe. Because <laughs> I don't increase the price for the leopard. But this one I do. And this one I guarantee that it's a leopard. This one when I sell, I guarantee means when I guarantee if it doesn't turn out to be a leopard pipe, when it breeds, I give them uh, another one for free. But I guarantee this one and I'm very confident on this one. But this one I'm not very confident because the moment I notice leopards always work like almost like a spike. They get a very high white. The father is also very high white. The father has like this, the tail and the head, but this part he doesn't have. If this if this fella doesn't have this part, this this orange bright part, I would guarantee this is a leopard. Mm. But because it has that I now I'm confused. So 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 that's the only way you guarantee a leopard, just very high white. High white. Yes. And the head is very very black. But can you say the high white always a leopard? No. No no no. <laughs> that is the risk. <laughs> but the head looks quite different. Uh, you see the head color. Yeah. It's pretty damn black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The other side. Yeah. It, it, this one yeah. compared to this is that this yes. one. The head is very way. black. You see that gold gold line. Yeah. That gold line, everything become a bit darker. Darker. You see that plus head. Because the problem is a leopard doesn't have a doesn't have a different head compared to other stuff that much. But if you notice, there's a lot of similarity with the the gold color is very dark. Yeah. It's not as bright. Uh, I, 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 I can see that. But it's very little difference there. Ninety percent of the time, I don't guarantee. But there's some special ones like that. Then I guarantee. So this one I sell uh, almost uh, thirty percent more than that. But that one I still sell as a high white pack price. Black pastel as, as well. Yeah, all the dark Authentic stuff. as well. The dark stuff. Sable. Sable. <laughs> Sable, also. Sable. <laughs> Sable also is like that. Yeah, I don't know why, but I, I also tell people the, the, the dark one, just be careful. Yes. If you want a nice five bit snake, get a Lucy snake. Yes, <laughs> get something that's white, like, mm. uh, like uh, even albinos are not too bad. Yeah, but, uh, not too bad. Yeah, but what, what do you think these are? Genix, maybe. I, 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 I can't guess yeah, we, any we, other genes. We don't know either. Yeah, if you say that it's from Justin, maybe the Genex. The mother, the mother... But you said you just got it after like four, four breeding, right? Eight years old. From four or five breeding? No, five breeding. Five breeding. Maybe you just get unlucky until today. <laughs> yeah, you're not That's very lucky. Really. Yeah, 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 I'm not very lucky in Arturo. You are seen. What, what are your what's your collection primarily focused on? You do lavenders, you do clowns. I do clowns. Mostly clowns. Clowns. Yeah. Uh, I am famous for my clowns. But and then I put the clowns in other recessive genes as well. Right. Yeah. Right. But it always comes back to clowns, so yeah. you always join up at the, at the end back into clowns. Yeah, I, I what, what about dark darker morphs in your clowns, like GHI clowns? You uh like his bright side. I am a bright side. So yeah. uh, I I'm in bright side. <laughs> but after looking for Justin stuff these couple years, 
I'm going to duck. <laughs> I'm going duck. Some, some of that magma Pompeii stuff is yeah. just awesome. Awesome. You, you, you saw the latest post? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The magma That's unbelievable. Like, oh, yeah. Unbelievable. It's, uh, and and you, you, don't, you never really know until you try what it's going to look like. Because sometimes when you mix the genes up, it comes out totally different to what you expect it's going to look like. And, and that's what Justin's stuff look like now. It's never imaginable. Never think, I, I, I never think a clown can look like that. The yeah. red side going up, yeah. and then the front wheel. That's why we want. That's why we want the red stripe. Yeah, we get the red stripe. Yeah, I, I also got the red stripe. I got the red stripe hurricane at clown. Some really cool stuff going to come out of that. In the you, you, you don't. You don't think about hurricane. We uh, think about all sorts of stuff, but there's, there's just so many genes that we don't have yet, e yeah. even like basic morphs that we don't have in Malaysia. I, I mean, leopard clown. We have to make our own hats. Yeah, yeah. We're, trying, we're trying for a Batman because we don't have any leopard clowns in our collection. So he made uh, squadless head clowns, I made leopard head clowns. Yeah, but actually uh, the leopard <coughs> clowns in Indonesia also, also came from me. Yeah. Because I'm the first one to import a pastel leopard head clown. Yeah. But there's, there's so much else you can do with leopard clowns other than other than the Batman. And, and so many Batman combos that haven't been done. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time.